What's up guys, it's Jake. Today I wanna to talk to you about the Rolo printer. I wanna take a couple minutes and show you the product and then talk about a few pros and cons to see if it is the right printer for you. So the Rolo thermal printer, let me start by seeing if we can zoom in here and give you a good look at the printer itself. You'll see the button right here on top, which is really the only button you're going to need to use this. You can see the power switch right back here on the back and the two places you're gonna plug in, one for your USB into your computer and the other will be your power. The only other thing is right here on the side is where you are going to open the printer. Now, this is going to allow you to change the size make sure we can get the focus in, change the size um, of the label you're using. So whether you want to use a 4x6 label or whether you want to use a smaller individual label, you'll have those options simply by changing the blue parts right here. All you'll have to do is pull them in to match the type of label you want to use. So there's a lot we could talk about with this label. I know there's obviously a lot in the description, uh, in the Q&A on Amazon itself, but there are a few things that I really wanted to hit to help you make a decision whether this is the right uh, thermal printer for you. Um, the first thing that I really love about the Rolo printer, I've used it for a few months now, and one of my favorite things is how compact it is. Um, this thing is really easy to move if I need to. Um, if I need to move into the other room because I'm doing some work over there, uh, if I need to move it into the office because I'm doing some work there, it's really easy to pick up and move. There's not much to it. There's only two cords. Very, very compact, lightweight, which is a big, big bonus for me. The other thing I really like about this is so far I have had zero issues using it. Um, I've used printers in the past and had a lot of different issues with them. So to go a few months with zero issues on, issues on a printer is always nice. The other thing I've really liked about the Rolo printer so far is the setup process was very, very, very simple. Uh, again, I kind of had some issues setting up printers in the past, had to call um, the owner of the company before, and it's just a hassle that you don't want to deal with. With this one, their walk, walkthrough on their website to set up all the software you needed for it has been very, very, very simple for me. I thought about um, setting this up so I could actually print something for you, um, but you've all seen what the actual print looks like. The print is clear. It looks really, really good. Um, and I wanted to actually be able to pick it up and show it to you. Um, and I'm sure you can look at another video that will go if you actually want to see the print itself. But I've never had an issue with the print being too light or anything like that. The only negative that I've had when it comes to the Rolo printer is if you want it to be wireless. This does have to be connected with a USB, which comes with the packaging. To me, that hasn't been an issue, but if it is for you, that is the only thing that would stop me from purchasing this is if that was an issue. Otherwise, I'm a massive fan of the Rolo thermal printer. I've used a lot of different thermal printers and bang for your buck, if you were looking at this price point, I just don't think there's one out there that is better than Rolo. And if there is, that is the one I'd be reviewing and that is the one that I would be using. Hopefully this was helpful for you. If you do have any more questions, go onto the Amazon page or wherever you are and add a question there. And I'm sure someone will get back to you with an answer. Hope this was helpful.